Come, let us sing unto the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation. I've got a deep desire to give him praise. God is so awesome. Yes, he is. But he just keep unfolding this make the impossible possible. Come on. He said, because the people with this storm, yeah. you got to make some things impossible possible. You don't That's know right. which way this storm going. That's right. But That's so right. many times God said, wait a minute, let me show you something. Come on. Genesis, the 32nd chapter. And give me that 24th through the 30th verse. And then overseer, you give me uh, Job. James, give me James, the fifth chapter, 10th and 11th verse. Don't put your fire Come on. if you really had a fire. Yeah. See, it's just like fire shut up in shut my up. bones. Yes, and I can't hold my peace. Yeah. I gotta praise him. I gotta glorify him. I gotta give him honor. Oh, yeah. oh cause he's worthy. Oh, yeah. He's worthy oh, yeah. of the praise. Yeah. He's worthy of the honor. And he's shown not worthy of the glory. Well, yeah. James, son, read. James 5 and 10. Uh -huh. Take my brethren, uh -huh. the prophet, uh -huh. who have spoken in the name of the Lord. Go ahead. For an example of... Watch this now. Who did he speak in? Name of the Lord. I can't hear you. Name of the Lord. See, when you open your mouth and speak, you got to speak in the name of the Lord. Not in your name, not in your ability, not in your own might, but in the name of the... Lord, reason for an example uh -huh. of suffering affliction. Wait a minute. So you mean to tell me Job was an example for us? Yes, sir. For suffering and afflictions? So you say, how, wait a minute, how I'm going to make this impossible possible in my suffering and in my, in my affliction? Reason. And the patience. And the what? And the patience. Roderick, patience. Patience. I said, no, you examine that word patience. And look at patience. There's so many people. My people don't have patience to wait on me. He said, they get in a hurry and they get fearful because things are not happening the way they think they ought to happen. What's patience, Roderick? Patience. Uh huh. The ability to be long suffering. The what? The ability to be long suffering. Oh, I don't think they heard you. The ability to be long suffering. The ability to be long suffering. You got to have the ability in you, which is Christ in you, the hope of glory, that you got to have that ability to suffer long. Go ahead, son. Capable of tolerating something. What? Capable of tolerating something. Capable of tolerating something. So many times the people of God is not capable of tolerating your trials and your tribulations that you go through. Go ahead, son. Enduring the pain. What? Enduring the pain. And God said, why do you think I afflict your body with pain? I want you to see what it's like and you endure the pain. How are you going to tell the people when you ain't enduring nothing? That's right. What is your testimony if you ain't never went through nothing? Amen. What is your testimony to know that, hey, wait a minute, God is a healer. Amen. God can put food on your table. Amen. God can give you a house when they put you out on the street. Amen. God can do anything but fail. Amen. Go ahead, son. Being steadfast. Oh. Come on. You being, ain't being steadfast. Come being on. what? Steadfast. Being what? Steadfast. Steadfast. Being steadfast. Come on. What we've been talking about? Steadfast. Anchored. Jesus is my anchor. Yes, sir. Steady, steadfast. And what? What? Sure. Sure of knowing that God can bring you through anything you go through. What else you got, Roger? That's it. So steady? Steadfast? Sure. Sure? Come on. Sure. Give me that, Shannon. Steady, steadfast, and sure? Yes, sir. What you say, overseer? Take my brother in the prophet. Uh huh. Who has spoken in the name of the Lord. Uh huh. For an example. Go ahead. Of suffering affliction. Uh huh. And of patience. And of patience? And of patience. Uh huh. Behold. Uh huh. We count 
them happy. We count them sad. We count them happy. We gon' praise in our praise we and our dance. We count them happy. We do what? We count them happy. We count them sad. Happy. Happy. Which endure. That which what? Which endure. We count them happy which endure. Endure what? Whatever you're going through. Endure. Go ahead. You have heard of the patience of Job. Uh-huh. And have seen the end of the Lord. Wait a minute. He said, you've seen the patience of Job. He said, I let Job go through all this stuff to show you the patience that you got to have. He said, you saw the patience of Job and you saw his end. God gave him a double portion. He blessed him more than what he had before because he endured patience but he wasn't sad he kept giving God the glory yes. how much complaining are you doing Come on. what are you saying in your spirit man are you clapping your hands and praising God Yes, sir. what you say overseer Come on. you have heard of the patient of Job uh -huh. and have seen the end of the Lord go ahead that the Lord is very pitiful uh -huh. and of tender mercy and he's of tender mercy. Of tender mercy. Uh huh. But above all things, uh -huh. my brethren, swear not. Wait a minute, wait a minute. He's of tender mercy? Of tender mercy. Come here, Shannon. I see overseer. Yes, sir. I'm ready. Now, now, now he said you, you're happy with your endure. He said, do you want me to do Jesus as my anchor? On, I hand. told you. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Listen, listen.
So you need to be saying Jesus is my anchor. You know the prayers of a righteous man avail in much with God. But you got to have that patience to stand right there and say Jesus is my anchor. And he's steadfast. He's unmovable. He's sure. And he's steady. He ain't going to move. Just like that storm moving slow. Jesus said it doesn't matter how slow the storm moves. He said because I'm in the storm. And I turn it whichever way I want. Because I'm behind the storm. And I send it where I want to send it. So when you're going through some rough waters. the storm and the water and the rain is pouring down he said you gotta let me guide you I gotta be your anchor I'm steady I'm sure and I'm steadfast but you gotta know he said I'm the eye of that storm he said but in the midst of everything around you he said they may run out of water he said they may run out of gas. He said, but Jesus will never run out. He said, I got everything you need. He said, when you need some water, he said, I'm your water. He said, when you need some bread, he said, I'm your bread. He said, when you need a helping hand.
to rock a little bit. Sometimes it may get a little weary, but you got to say I'm sailing on. I'll never be moved because I'm anchored in Jesus. I don't care how much water flows. I don't care how much wind blows. I got Jesus as my anchor. I trust you got Jesus as your anchor. Now, now Shannon, I'm going to flip this a little bit. See, you got to start thanking God for protecting us before the storm even get here. Now, Tim, say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. for protecting me.
So you stay. Say what? Yeah. He'll keep you steady through the storm. He'll keep you steady through the rain. Yeah. He'll keep you steady through the wind. He'll keep you steady. He'll keep you steady through the storm and the rain. He'll keep you steady. Go clap my hands. That's why I'm going to stomp my feet. That's why I'm going to do my dance. Because he keeping me steady. And every time I turn around, I see more blessings. So sometimes you have to turn around through your storm to see the blessings. I see more blessings. Of everything I need. Now watch this here. I'm shifting. Harry. Genesis 32. 24. Watch this. Now we're going back to patience. Yes, sir. But sometimes you got to wait on him. It may look rough, but God said, wait on it. Wait on it. Be patient and wait on it. He said, look at Jacob. He said, he wouldn't let the angel go. I was that angel, but I put the angel in my stead. He said, but he had patience to hold on. Read, Harry. Genesis 32 and 24. What does it say? And Jacob was left alone. Uh-huh. And there wrestled a man with him until the breaking of day. Go ahead. And when he saw that he prevailed not against him. Wait a minute. Why you think that the angel couldn't prevail against Jacob? Because of Jacob's consistent patience to hold on. Yes, sir. Through no matter what circumstances look like, you got to hold on. Yeah. Read, son. He touched the hollow of his thigh. Uh-huh. And the hollow of Jacob's thigh uh -huh. was out of joint. It was out of joint. Was out of joint. Now, can you imagine your thigh being out of joint? Your leg being out of joint, and you got to be in some excruciating pain. But God said, through Jacob, persistent, and his patience to hold on and not give up, I got a blessing. Read, son. And his tie was out of joint uh -huh. as he wrestled with him. As he wrestled with him. Jesus. Have you ever tried to hold on to something and fight? And it just, it's like so much pain and so much you're going through. And you're like, I I'm trying to hold on, but I ain't going to ain't gonna turn it loose. Because I know what God told me. God told me he's going to bless me. God told me he was steady. He was steadfast and he was sure. So I'm going to hold on. Read, son. And he said, let me go. Uh-huh. For the day break. Wait a minute. So the angel tells Jacob, let me go. Because the day is breaking. I got to go. Mm. Jacob said, no, 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 no. I'm patient. I'm holding on till I get what I came here for. I came here for a blessing. And I'm holding on till I get what I asked for. Read, son. And he said, I will not let thee go. Uh-huh. Except. I bless me. What? I will not let thee go. See, that's the problem with a lot of saints. They let go before they get their blessing. Because you're looking at circumstance instead of looking at the God that can do anything, do the impossible and make it possible. Well, yes. He said, I ain't letting you go till you bless me. I tell God that all the time. I ain't turning loose till you bless me. I ain't turning loose till you bless me. You got a blessing for me. And I'm holding on in patience and waiting on you. Read, son. And he said, I will not let thee go. Uh-huh. Except thou bless me. I ain't going to let you go. What? Except thou bless me. Jacob said, hey, I ain't turning you loose until you bless me. And that's how you got to be. 
You got to have patience and persistence to hold on to God. Give you what you ask him for. Read, son. And he said unto him, Uh huh. What is thy name? He said, What's your name? What's your name? You don't need to know my name, but I'm going to give you a new name. God said, Hey, wait a minute. I got a name for you. And that name is blessings. That name is making the impossible possible. Read, son. And he said, Jacob. Uh huh. And he said, thy name shall be called no more Jacob. Then his name ain't going to be called Jacob no more. Yeah. But Jacob want to know, what's your name, angel? <laughs> well, you don't need to know my name. I gave you a new name. Yeah. Read, son. Thy name shall be no more called Jacob, uh-huh. but Israel. Uh-huh. For as a prince. For a, as a what? For as a prince. Because of his patience, God made him a prince. prince. I say because of his patience, God made him a Y'all sorry, y'all sorry. Because of his patience, God made him prince. Go ahead, son. For as a prince Uh has a power with God. Wait a minute. Because of his patience, God said, you got power with me. Because you wouldn't give up. The song sound good. Jesus is my anchor. But God said, hey, wait a minute. If you hold on through your storms of life, he said, I got some blessings for you. He said, but you got to hold on. But in the process of holding on, you got to praise me. You got to be happy and endure. Read, son. For as a prince has the power with God Uh and with men. So God said, wait a minute. Because you didn't give up. Because your patience was that mind that you could do anything but fail. He said, I'm going to give you power over the angels and with man and with me because of your patience and not giving up. Stop looking at the way things look and look at the impossible be made possible. Go ahead, son. And has prevailed. Uh huh. Verse 29. Uh huh. And Jacob asked him and said, what, what Jacob asked him? Tell me, I pray thee, thy name. Tell me your name. Read. And he said, wherefore is it that thou asked after my name? Why are you asking my name? I don't gave you a name. Go ahead. And he blessed him there. And he blessed him right there. Because of his patience. Yes, and not giving up. God said, if you have patience and wait on me, I got a blessing for you. I got a blessing that you won't even believe. Because you stand firm and trust me. Trust God through your storm. And let him be your anchor. Yes, sir. Wait on him. God said, wait a minute. Tell the people to wait on me. Yes, sir. But in the process of them waiting on me. Praise me. In the process of waiting on God. Praise him. Give him glory. Come on. Clap. Come on. Clap your hands.
walk by faith. Don't just stand there and wait, but you gotta do something while you wait. So while you wait, you're praising him. While you wait, you're clapping your hands. While you wait, you're praying. While you wait, you're walking in faith. So do what, Shannon? Let's go. Tell your next door neighbor. Just whisper. 
Lord, come. I'ma praise Him while I wait. 